Hello everyone and welcome back to Stitched. Oh, the microphone's a little too close. Alright, there we go. Um, so what were we doing this time? I think last time we just found our way up here. Um, yeah, okay, I know where we are now. We saw, like, quite a number of ways to go. Um, I'm leaving that door shut, okay. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Did I check this yet? Yeah, I did. Okay. That's just the mirror. Oh, we have another spool of thread right there. An office. It's locked. Oh, wait. A joint room. Hmm. Another unusual room. Oh, her again. Miss Catherine. There you are, Miss Catherine. Hello. Hello. So good to see that you're safe. Same to you too. You seem to be lost in thought. Maybe I ask why. Um, what is on your mind? Oh yes, I do happen to know any. <clears throat> <coughs> do you happen to know anything about this place? I believe this is the joint room. To open the locked door ahead, the layout of both areas need to be the same. How what a strange place. Oh, okay. Anyway, would you mind answering some questions? Not at all. What would you like to know about? This is a puzzle to test one's intelligence designed just specifically by Mr. Stockholms. Father does have a strong love for puzzles. He would often think of several in his free time and, and uh, persuade me to solve them. I found them frustrating. I felt like a lab rat, but looking back on it now, I think he was just trying to help me develop complex thinking. I have some questions. Oh, no, 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 no. Oops. Opening the door. As I mentioned earlier, the door, the open, yeah, to open the door, you need to modify the layout of the left room to match the one in the right room. Survivors. I saw a few survivors, but they were attacked by dolls. What happened to them? Gone. Why didn't you help them? I roughly cannot. I'm not the um. I am not one who is capable of fending off those dolls. Young miss, please refrain yourself from associ um, associating with that boy. No good will come out of it. Why do you say that? Because his intentions is far from pure. Huh. Interesting. Also, I didn't hit the button there. What's this? Some paints in the crate. Oh. A cute teddy bear. Why is the one blue and the other two red? Maybe I should paint this bear. Okay, I get how this works. So it needs to be symmetrical. Now this is down to the finite detail? Nice. I guess it is. Wow. Huh, okay. I, I, I like puzzles like this. This is cool. I see this lamp is off. I probably need to turn this on. Great. Oh, God, that was bright. Um, <laughs> I see two bottles right here. Take a bottle. Probably place it next to this dresser. Um, how do I use it? Oh, I place it here. Um. <laughs> Is that it? No. I feel like we are almost done here. There's like a thing below the bed. Move it. Wait, what is that? Um, wait. Oh! Oh, wait up. Hold up. Um, a sturdy wooden sign. Okay, so that bench goes somewhere else. It looks like it goes, um... I just locked myself out of completing this. I can't walk on this tile because that's, um, where the sign is supposed to go. Uh, hopefully it'll reset. Yes, it does. Did everything else reset too? 
No, it looks like everything else um, stayed the same. Okay, that's good. Oh, wait. Oh, come on. I'm not good at these sorts of puzzles. I like them, I'm just not good at them. Um, okay. I only need to push this up one. And it's some... No. Huh. Come on, this is simple. Oh, come on. You know, I might as well place this down right now, just so it doesn't get in the way. Is this possible, though, to push it upwards? Okay, I probably need to push it downwards. Because if I push it up from here, I can't get it to the right. If I push it right from here, I can't get it up. So what I probably need to do is I probably need to do this the long way. Um, I can go through here, right? Yes. Okay. <laughs> the doll is actually in the way. <laughs> the doll is making this harder. Wait, wait. Okay, I think I almost just locked myself out again. I like how I spent more time in this one object than anything else in this room. Alright, cool. Now it's aligned with the other cabinet. Is that everything? I feel like there must be something I'm missing. Oh! Hold up. Um, I see something. Take the vase. And does that vase go anywhere? What's this outlet for? Am I missing something? I must be missing something. I swear that's all of it. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Mm. This doesn't feel right. Nice. There we go. Okay. <laughs> okay, I like that puzzle. That was a good one. Strange. strange. Both rooms look the same. Am I missing something? Maybe I should console with the doll. I think I still have that vase. Do you require my assistance? I've done what you said, but why is the door still locked? Perhaps you should try standing in a specific okay. spot. I see, thank you. Oh, okay, okay. Wait, do you need two people to do this room? Uh, you're standing like... Yeah, like right there. Huh? Huh. Done. <laughs> Impressive work, Miss Catherine. I should talk to the doll first. Fine. Ready to go? Sorry. I apologize, I'm only able to for, uh, two for the need for I need some rest. But you're a doll. The internal mechanisms of my body are rusty and can cause me to lock up every now and then. Well, okay, I'll meet you on the third floor then. I will see you there. Please be quiet. Uh, please be safe. I must say, please be quiet. Oh no. I think this is my first real good look at the bear. He reminds me of something. I don't know what it is. Also, I forgot to save, or I didn't I haven't saved yet. Um Let me let me save my game. Okay, thank you. Um 
Let's look around a little more. I see this over here. I, I still can't get that? How are you supposed to get that? Huh. There must have been something on the other side I missed, perhaps. I need to retrieve the silver key before moving further. What is this room? It's not telling me. Okay. We knew uh, what we were doing is wrong, yet we continued on, all for the sake of a blind ambition. And even after succeeding, we bit more than we could chew. This is our punishment for toying with human life. This is the end that we deserve. There are two rooms there, but I'll go through this one first. Mister, are you all right? Thank goodness he's still breathing. Wait, we found like an actual alive person in here? That noise, the dolls. Please wake up. Get away. Huh? What do you do to me? Leave me alone. But I just... Stay away from me, you freak. Oh, because I look like a doll. That's probably why he's reacting that way. I'm sorry. Hide before the dolls breach the area. Not that way. No. Uh, hmm. What places do I have to hide? The door bursts, two large dolls rush inside. One tackles Catherine to the ground, with the other ma makes quick work of the injured man. The doll playfully stomps on Catherine as, as the girl struggles for freedom. After a few minutes, the creature slams its giant foot on Catherine's head. That's probably a game over. Yep, okay. I spent too long checking the doors there. What's this room? That's just another office. There's a lot of offices here. Yep, we know this. Um, what is this? Nope, that's a locker. Weird? Huh? Hmm. <laughs> I must have missed something. I mean, I wish I could skip this. It's not a very long scene, but, yeah. You know what? Hold up. I'm gonna use one of my speed pills. Look for an area. Look for a way out. Wait, that's only how long it lasts? Oh, hmm. I wonder what would happen if I were to save. Because there's a save spot up there. Also, those speed pills really do not last that long. Okay. And just in case this is on a timer, I'm going to save here. But then I'm... Oh, I can't save there. No. Alright, that's jammed. You get barely any time to do that. Hold up. Actually, it might even be faster to just reset the game. Yeah, that is faster. Okay. 
Maybe I should use my sight pill and just see what the room looks like. Interesting, you can't use it during a cutscene. Okay, what does this room look like? I don't see any good hiding spots. I really don't. The only thing that stands out in the room is that chair. The last place I'm thinking is maybe that door up there. I really hope that's the that that's what I'm supposed to be looking for, because I can't think of anything else in this room that I could hide in. And I've done this like five times so far. Given how much time they give me though, I can very easily see that being the case. Oh good, okay. I probably still need to find a place to hide though. Uh, you moved automatically, then. Eh, yeah, whatever. I left him to die. Let me move the window real quick. There we go. Why am I always so weak? I should keep moving. Monitors everywhere. This must be a surveillance room. A video footage. <laughs> what was on that footage? Wow! <laughs> oh? What the heck? The dark figure is controlling the dolls. She's the one behind the whole nightmare. Is that the dark figure that's been chasing us? I wonder. Oh, you again. Wait. Oh, there's a doll over there. Okay, let's talk to you first. Hello, Fi um, hey, Fi. Did you see an injured man laying around here? I brought him to my room to meet Mom and Dad. He was the one who promised us a new place to live. You found your Mom and Dad? Not yet, but close. I just want him to be there when my, when my parents get back. Can I see your room? Soon. Let me collect enough thread first. Oh, I can't exchange with him right now. Okay. I feel like you might get a different ending if you give him enough thread or not. Odd, wasn't, wasn't there a door here? It was broken down. Also, I want to see what those notes say. Hold up. Fast the homeless, now children as well. First the homeless, now children as well. Stockholms, where is your compassion? That does not tell us anything. Oh, there's another stack of um, notes over there. Okay, why are there like two in here? Oh? I think I'm gonna die as soon as I come out of this cutscene. Oh, hold up, uh, that's a new code. That is a floor code, those are very useful. I almost completely missed that. Okay, we'll call that one F2 code. Okay. I think that's going to be enough for this time. I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching.